Hello and good day. I just want to make a short video uh, to give you some important information. I'm directing this mainly at the supporters, subscribers, the viewers and the decent people out there because I know that from my experience the decent people out there will probably not be aware of all the things that go on in the background. When I first started this channel in 2016, I was a young, naive YouTube vlogger with many ideals and many beliefs that I could make a difference in the vlogging world. My own personal circumstances mean that I have to overcome disability and prejudice. I also now realise that I have to overcome other things such as hate and jealousy from people who should know better really to be honest. So while I'm not addressing them directly and by them I'm, I'm referring to the uh, the small minority of brain dead, idiotic, low IQ morons. The ones that see fit to make disparaging threats to threaten to beat me up and wish me dead, basically. And for the for the average person, I I keep this information to myself because. You don't need to know. It's not worth knowing. And that old saying about the more you focus on it, the more they do it. I'm still trying to work out if that's true or not because I have ignored it and it's still there. In fact, as of last night, it seems to be escalating slightly. Probably because they're not getting a reaction. And my channel is a moderated channel, which means that if you leave a comment, I have to approve it first before it appears. So anybody that's left a comment, apart from my personal moderators, you have to wait to, to uh, view your comment on my channel. In this way, I can protect myself and my channel from a certain amount of abuse. Now this comment that I referred to is just one of many that I've had and apparently this is a result of the escalation in, in the fact that they are these um, brain dead idiots are making fake accounts. I can blame Google for that because it is Google's responsibility that they should not allow a person to have more than one account. But there are no checks. Even when a channel has been removed for violations of the regulations, they can just make another account. Start again. In the same way that a person can have 5, 10, 20 different accounts, all with different names, and they control any of the regular channels, and there are quite a few that they do, mine included, and has been so since the very beginning uh, of, of the career. And to be fair, I don't know what they they're trying to achieve by that. The type of person that's doing this is what we call a keyboard warrior. They're quite happy to sit at home and call everybody under the sun everything that they can because they can. Accuse them of things that they've done that they think they've done that they haven't. And of course the latest uh, incident is that I have been commenting on various YouTube channels which I have not 
the last comments I was making, uh, and I regret doing that because the only thing it encourages is trolls. When they see my comment, they just attack it with abuse. And there's nothing I can do about it because it's not my channel. So the abuse stays there. So for the last two years, I have limited my commenting to just a couple of channels that I like and I have actually unsubscribed from all the rest of them because the the Thailand vlogger genre is rife with these morons unfortunately so I rarely watch Thailand vloggers the ones I do watch are, are actually my personal friends so I want to make it perfectly clear that if you see my name or that name of my wife or name of any family member with the name right, you can pretty much assume that it's not me or my family. Uh, my wife's uh, fake account Apparently she's got very good English now, suddenly, and she knows how to swear uh, and abuse people, uh, apparently. So, well done to her. That will save me some money when it comes to the visa and doing the English exam. I've been contacting Google for a long time. I report the abuse. I report the fake accounts. And I've been in conversation with them since March. When all I can say is the the uh, abuse has increased. And if you do see any comment in my name, I haven't found the account yet, but I'm sure it's out there. It will definitely be a fake account. I cannot tell you to report these because it contravenes the YouTube guidelines. However, I would urge you to, to, to actually do the right thing, right? Because there's an easy way to check. I'm going to show you a fake account and a real account. And this one is for my friend who died, Kevin Thailand, Kevin Burt. Here is the fake account that's been abusing me. And here is the real account. As you can see, there are videos on the real account. Even though they use the same icon, the fake account has usually no videos. Here's another one. Here's a, a guy called Johnny. Uh, and here's the fake account, and here is the real account. As you can see, there are videos on the real account, and of course there are other there are other fake accounts. Here is my wife's fake account. She doesn't have a YouTube account like that. Anyway, I've gone on for quite a long time, and. I want to reiterate that if you do if you do see anything in my name, do the right thing. Uh, probably, if you have evidence, then I would be happy to receive it, a screenshot or whatever you have. However, screenshots can be forged quite easily, so. It may not be a good thing to do. A last important message to the brain dead half wit morons. I don't know what you're expecting to happen. And unfortunately, I'm not the sort of chap who allows people to tell me what to do. Certainly from a very young age. Oh, you can never do that. Oh, you can never walk. Oh, you can never get a job. Oh, you can never do this. Oh, you can never get married. Oh, you can never do this. Yeah, all right. Well, that's your opinion. Uh, and I have no intention of, of bringing that 
opinion truth but if you actually spent more time improving your own life then you might be happier have a good day and bye for now